What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back on the Sorceress main playthrough. We need to talk to Sarma Amin to start out this episode. The very existence of Shroud Knights is only to serve Barids the Third. The Shroud Knights have sworn to protect Prince Barids with their lives. Is uh, my lieutenants told me what you did for Otto Farm. I guess you're not just all talk after all. I will have it out with Elezra before leaving Medea. While you were taking care of things at Otto Farm, Neruda Shen visited. We had quite the discussion. He promised he would do everything in his power to support the Shroud Knights, claiming that he only wants what is best for Medea. Oh, please don't get me wrong. I don't trust Neruda Shen completely, but his offer was quite enticing. Perhaps you could get an audience with His Highness Prince Barids and ask for his opinion. Glory How exactly am I supposed to get an audience Glory. with Prince Barids just walk in there willy-nilly? Got a contribution point from that. So that's nice. Is Prince Barid's just hanging? Oh no, where is it? What did I see? What did what was I thinking? Okay. I didn't look at the where is this trying to take me? Holy crap. Okay. It's all jacked up because I'm in a weird spot that's not really the correct spot. This is where I need to go. Down here. There we go. Gives us the correct way through everything. That was weird because it wanted. It was trying to take you like the right way, like the road route, but it was it was a really weird route. And hello. Oh, all right, Prince Barides. We may have close ties to Valencia, but they are not the same as us. I am the rightful ruler of Medea. Ah, if it isn't Neruda Shen's right hand, what brings you here? I don't know if I want... I don't really want to be considered his right hand. I do not trust Neruda Shen. He is like a serpent hiding in the grass, waiting to strike the moments his prey is vulnerable. If his intentions are truly for the good of Medea, then of course such a refusal would be a petty thing indeed. Consider this alliance provisional, and I will be watching you two very closely. The moment I detect even a hint of trees and the ceasefire is over and hostilities will resume. Please inform Mahdi Budar of my conditions. Perhaps if it is written in the annals, Shen will think twice about betraying me. If you offer help, I shall give you gold. Alrighty then. Go talk to Mahdi Budar. Hello, friend. Greetings, Yennefer. Goodness, climbing this hill always leaves me lightheaded. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Where are my manners? Allow me to introduce myself. Mahdi Budar at your service. Historian and advisor to His Highness, Prince Barids. I do believe I have seen you once before discussing some matters of importance with... Uh, Naruda Shen. The Shen Merchant Guild wishes to form an alliance? This is wonderful news. This is truly a day to record in the annals. Uh, as a member of the Shen Merchant Guild, what is your opinion on the matter? Oh, I've no doubt Naruda Shen's intentions to rebuild Medea are sincere, but then would he justify anything if it was done for the good of Medea? What if he suddenly has other plans? What if the crown prince becomes an obstacle rather than an ally? Surely you are not so naive to think such a thing could never happen. The history books are littered with examples of this, and history does have a tendency to repeat itself. As a precaution, I have petitioned Valencia to grant asylum to Prince Barides so that he may remain out of the harm's way until he comes of age. This way, we can protect the Barid's royal line and Neruda Shen may govern as he sees fit. I believe this way, both sides win. The Valencian delegation is coming to investigate a site of historical importance, so I must bid my farewells and be on my way. Okay, return to Neruda Shen and tell him Maudi Budar's plan. I really want to just fight the witch. Like, this is, like, heavy dialogue to, like, the point that I'm like, oh, we got, like, a bunch of story left. But according to looking at this, we don't have that many left. We're about to be done rebuilding the Merchant Guild, and we're going to be to reliving the darkness. Which makes things interesting. All right, Neruda Shen. 
Yes, I had heard rumors that the prince was seeking asylum. So Maudi Budar has gone to the ancient ruins to negotiate the prince's asylum with the Valencian delegation. Do not get me wrong. I understand why they wish to send Prince Barid somewhere safe, but it is completely unnecessary. I do wish people would have a little more faith in me. I tire of the incessant whispering that I am trying to take the throne for myself. Why do they? Why do you think they whisper so? I have no children, no heirs. I have neither a wife to bear me sons, nor even a lover. My only desire is to rebuild Medea. What would I gain from forming a new kingdom as an aging man with no successor? I deeply hope that you at least can trust me. Mine trapped in the darkness. Moving on to other matters, I must ask again for your service. There seems to be problems at the mines north of Altanova. I sent someone to investigate the recent decrease in population or populate production, and they reported back claiming that the miners are all suffering from terrible nightmares. Did you not mention to me before that you were searching for the witch possessed of dark energy? Is it at all possible that the two are connected? This may prove of interest to you. Go to the mines and find out what exactly has happened. Is All right. So we're back to doing simple bidding. All right. Okay, autopathing. Autopathing, please. Autopath correctly. Thank you. Okay, let's see here. Let's check our central market. Ooh, price changed on items. Five million for those is not bad. I think I have better, yeah, better stuff already, but that's not bad price. We sold this for 275,000. That's nice. Okay, so I need to work on getting better attack on this character. Which, there's not a whole lot of stuff to work with here. Probably just need to get a better necklace. Ah, uh, could get a better earring that's not defensive based. That's probably what I need to do next. Or upgrade this stuff. Uh, that's an option as well. But we do have some stuff. We don't have a lot of stuff. But we do have, we do have some stuff to work with. All right, Northern Mines. Where are we on the map? Okay, just north of Altanova. Who am I supposed to talk to? Just this random villager. The miners keep complaining of nightmares. How am I supposed to meet my quotas? Hey, aren't you Yennefer? What brings you out here? Please inform Lord Shen I will have the mines back to full output as soon as possible. Shen Merchant Guild's concern. Sigh. The workers have been slacking off lately. The amount of black crystals being extracted has fallen by half. The workers keep complaining that they're having terrible nightmares that are affecting their ability to work. It's obvious to anyone that they're just using this as an excuse to be lazy. If Lord Shen finds out about this, there will be big trouble. Can you talk to them for me? My throat is already sore from constantly screaming at them. You can do anything as long as it works. Um... Speak with the worker. Just anybody? Aren't you part of the Shen's Merchant Guild? You rich folk are all the same. Okay. Have you even worked a single day of your pampered, privileged life? All you merchant types do is count your profit at massive desks. Do you know how many people have collapsed while working under the scorching sun? Only yesterday, several workers quit because they were having hallucinations. How are we supposed to meet our quotas in these conditions? I don't want to speak to some idealist that won't even lift his finger, so please kindly piss off. All right, move the cart full of ore. Really, this is what this has come to? I'm moving carts of ore. Oh, what the? Um, hello? How do you do this? Wait. Oh, okay, there we go. Go, go, go. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> this is kind of fun. Uh, get it back, get it, no! I suck. Okay, pick it back up. Pick it. We're almost there. Bring it. Bring it back. There we go. There. There we go. We're here. We're here. Just put it down. Medea has been so gloomy these days. The people are losing. Pushing a cart is harder than I thought. Haha. <laughs> Not as easy as it looks, is it? But you gave it a bash, kid. You're all right in my book. Ah, ain't easy. So how does real hard labor feel? Ready for a lie down? Look, I'll level with you. Things are bad here. 
But seriously, the workers are here are getting ill. At night, many of them have terrible nightmares and suffer hallucinations during the day. Of course, the work is hard, but at least we weren't seeing things before. A lot of the lads here can't trust their senses. One bloke started screaming the other day that his pickaxe had turned into a serpent. Wouldn't go near it again. The lads reckon it's dark energy and a sign of a Lezra's return. Truth be told, I can't say that I'm that bothered. It's time like these, I wish the barbarians were here doing the work instead of me. Alright, so we need to tell Ridley about the situation. We believe that they are telling the truth about the dark hallucinations. Travel west of Altanova and you will reach Tariff, the home of sorceresses. Wow, how appropriate. Their sorceresses are experts of dark energy, so we'll be able to tell you way much or way tell you much more on the subject. Go now to Tariff, you may discover something useful. Alright. Where is this on the map? Ooh, wow, this is really far. Wow, this is really far away. This is really far away. Alright, so I guess it's talking time. It's, it's good old talking time. So, I think I finally got my schedule fully fledged out and pretty much ready to go. So, I think the Witch playthrough and Final Fantasy are going to alternate days going forward. So, they'll be every other day, six days a week. And then on Fridays, it will be Elder Scrolls Online. Um, for that, there'll just be a simple episode. Wherever I am, we're picking up. We're going for a half hour, 45 minutes in Elder Scrolls Online. Trying to get ready for the Elsewhere DLC. Um, and so, yeah, that that's every Friday. Uh, so we'll have, there won't be many episodes of Elder Scrolls. I need to get back into that, playing that a lot more, um, if I'm going to make it anywhere near the Elsewhere DLC. I've just been speedrunning that. That's what we'll do in the videos. We'll just be running through, not paying too much attention to the story. we got to get to Elsewhere for that, and that comes out before the Final Fantasy stuff. So I can take my time a little bit in the Final Fantasy. I still need to pick it up in the Final Fantasy. I really do. I still need to pick that up. Um, I, I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit on the struggle of Final Fantasy. Um, I, you know, obviously I lost like the last six days with my room, my floor getting redone and rearranging my room and all of that stuff. So it feels like I'm behind, but we'll, we'll get back into the groove and I won't be so far behind. I feel like I'm behind on literally every video that I'm doing and every game that I've been playing. So hopefully we will, uh, we'll get it together and won't be too big of an issue. But yeah, I think that'll work out well. So it'll be like Monday. I think I'll do it this way. So Mondays will be Final Fantasies, Tuesdays, Witch. I don't know how many Witches we're going to have left. Once Witch is complete, it'll just be random Black Desert videos. Um, Sorceress will stay at night as long as I continue to have a daily video for it. I don't know what will move tonight afterwards. I, I kind of like having Final Fantasy in the morning. But there's still plenty of videos that I can do. For sorceress main but like the ranger when i finally fire up my ranger for the first time that that video obviously that can be that can be something we can we can have that but there's plenty of there's plenty of videos left before i start like brand new characters whenever dark knight comes out obviously that video will take over the night slot because I think that's a good, that'll be kind of a main point on the video. And I'm really looking forward to that. Because the three characters I have right now, Ranger, Sorceress, and Witch, they don't have a melee weapon. Like, Sorceress uses her Shadow Claws or whatever um, to, to attack. So uh, she doesn't have an actual, like, sword or an axe or whatever. She has, obviously, her, like, claws... Which obviously staff, ranger with the bow. The ranger gets that cool dagger, um, like dual daggers at awakening, I believe. Whoa, that's really cool, right there. We also need to work on like getting a house and doing all of that different stuff. So I'm looking forward to beating this. Like I don't want the story to end, but I'm really looking forward to getting into some of the end content. Okay. Ahna er Ahan Kuris. Ahan Kuris. I like that armor she's got on. Looks pretty nice. Okay. 
What we need to protect is not only We are descendants of the great sorceress Karshin. You are welcome here in Tariff. Welcome Your to Tariff. My name is Ahan Kuris, the chief of this village. Yennefer, I've heard a lot about you, so this is the famous right hand of Naruta Shen. What brings you to Tariff? I see a dark energy at the Altanova Mines. Have you heard of the Black Spirits? Looking into your eyes, it's clear that you know what I speak of. The presence of Black Spirits has been increasing in Medea, and the number of the people affected by their dark influence has grown. Even those who possess a strong will often cannot resist the Black Spirits whispering promises of power into their ears. Something has been stirring the dark powers ever since your arrival from the West. Scuffling the two, sir. We will carry on Okay. Um, do I just have to talk to you? Here we go. It was my fault How can we help desert. the workers? The hallucinations the workers are experiencing are no doubt caused by the dark energy that has been growing in Medea. We sorceresses are experts on the dark energy and by extension the black spirit. However, our methods of controlling the dark energy takes years to develop, time that the workers do not have. Therefore, we have to find another method. The workers do not need to control the dark energy, but simply need to know how to fight back against it. Try visiting the giants at the mausoleum. They have fought off the effects of the dark energy for many years. Find Tantu at the mausoleum. He might be able to help you. If you are also suffering because of the black spirit, you should ask for their help as well. What we need to protect is not only to What? How dare she? And when I'm right here, listening. You wouldn't be foolish enough to get rid of me, would you? Thought we were friends. Hee <laughs> hee. I won't go easy on you if you go to see Tantu. I have to go see Tantu. It's the next mission. I don't have a choice. We we have to go meet Tantu, Black Spirit. I don't want to get rid of you, but we do in fact have to go. Otherwise, otherwise I can't progress the story friend where is tantu it's just like all the way across the map again oh my gosh it's all the way across the map again i like how it's raining just right here that's it this episode is a lot of running and talking but like i said i'm looking forward to getting done with this because of all the cool like not end game because there's not a whole lot of end game other than pvp and life skilling and that type of stuff but um, I'm looking forward to, like, getting a house. That's always, like, one of my favorite things in games. It sounds so stupid, but it is. It's one of my favorite things in MMORPGs is getting a house and decorating it and doing cool stuff with my house. So, I'm really looking forward to that. As dumb as that is, I, though, am really looking forward to it. So, hopefully, hopefully, they have some good house mechanics i really like the houses in conquer except for the fact that you had to like teleport to them and it was just like super stupid how they designed them i'm hoping this is designed better and i'm hoping the like furniture and stuff is like super cool i hope there's like just a bunch of sick stuff you can get in there really looking forward to that see still ways to go let's see oh what did i want to check oh here we go i wanted to check my daily rewards yeah here we go we got that we got that our medea seals need to start saving them again i don't know how long i have before that promo ends it probably will tell me I accidentally used these again. I was trying to move it, like move them around, and I accidentally hit A while it was in a V. And yeah, sadness. Um, actually doesn't. Move that down here, move that there. Block that off. And I have this has filled up really quick. My inventory is is full of a lot of garbage need to clean that up but i don't have like any enough of them to trade in and i don't know if i'm gonna go back to farm it's just kind of one of those tough things i have to figure that out i'm assuming i don't know i'm assuming we'll have to fight giants there's probably like um nodes here and whatnot but that's all right we don't need those things perfectly connected right now I do want to invest in that. Ah, oh, it didn't connect it. I thought it would connect these, but that's all right. 
Bitch, all right. We'll get that whole map connected eventually. I'm assuming as long as you create characters, brand new characters, you're going to get the contribution points from doing missions and stuff like that. So I'm going to assume I can get almost unlimited contribution points if I want. How much are the character function slot expansion character slot? Oh, it's only 600. That's not bad at all. That's not bad whatsoever. 600 for an extra character. There's another node manager. Do I need to talk to you? I'm going to talk to you. Stop, 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 stop. What? It won't let me stop. What? The? Okay, there we go. It would not let me stop. That was weird. That was super. Now I'm like, can I please? Game. 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 Oh my gosh. Look at this. It won't let, it won't let me. It won't let me get up. There we go. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you always need <laughs> Thank you. I just wanted the no node. What was that? What was that? And it didn't even give me the node. Hold on. Go back. It didn't even give me the node. <laughs> this is this is tragic. This is this is the big sad right now. Can I At all times, can, There's no node here? Your Whatever. Okay. Yes, here we go. Let's let's get back on the road. We're back on the road again. <sighs> Did that node pop up finally, please? Maybe this was the node it was talking about. Ooh, look at this up here. I'm excited to go to that. We gotta go to that. That's gotta be something. Gotta be. Gotta be. If there's just nothing there, I'm gonna gonna be tragic it's gonna be the big sad how close are we we're pretty close this looks like a refugee camp more than like a a place where a main character would be i mean like look at this thing it's like run down and it's like dilapidated the middle's like fallen over this is a new enemy type not that we're going to be fighting the giant. I don't know if we're going to be fighting giants, but giants are... This is a new, like, race, I guess? Gi are giants a race? Okie dokie. Hello, fr well, you're not who I need to talk to. I'll grab side quests later just simply because we're full. And they pop up on the map. That That's the good thing, is like, they show up here. Uh, well, maybe. If you zoom in, most of these places will show up quests. Maybe, maybe I'm just... I thought they showed up. Maybe not. I think if you enter these places... Hold on. How do you enter... Is it just A? Mm. I think the blue is... Is the blue... I don't know. Okay, maybe I'm all wrong. Maybe I'm all wrong. But I thought the quest popped up on the map. All right, Tantu. You must train your mind to be able to withstand those that seek to control you. Have you heard of the three days of darkness in Medea? Welcome, foreigner. Ahan Kuris told you to come see me. It's been a while since she sent anyone. Huh, I see a dark shadow lingering near you. I hope I can be of help before it is too late. The dark chasers execute the will of the ancient giants and intend to rid the world of Elezra, the bringer of destruction. Rumor about the knowledge one. My kinsmen should be near the mausoleum um, at the moment. He likes to travel around Medea collecting knowledge. If you'd like to have a conversation with him, look for him around the mausoleum. He'd love to talk to you. The Dark, the dark Chasers execute the will of the ancient, ancient giants, giants and it's in the I already read this. Okay. The, dark the workers in Alta Nova are suffering from hallucination. I believe they're under the influence of dark energy. The only way to rid them of these hallucinations is to suppress the dark energy causing them. In the past, Medea sealed the dark energy using the ancient Bout Slate. The Bout Slate has protected Medea since time immemorial, immemorial, 
immemorial, <laughs> but it was unfortunately badly damaged during the three days of darkness. We haven't been able to restore its power, but we may be able to turn the broken pieces into paper talisman. Uh, we can transfer the power from the broken pieces into the parchment. They may be weak, but they still, but they will still offer some sort of resistance against dark energy. Why don't you talk to the giant standing behind me? He should be able to help you make the talisman. Perhaps there will be standing some behind you. Hello, giant clansman. I understand I will teach you how to make talisman. The bout slate was all about... All but destroyed during the three days of darkness. A huge explosion scattered pieces of it all over the mountain range. Uh, we don't have the right type of ore to rebuild a new bout slate. The best way we can do is to collect the scattered pieces and absorb what little power they have left. You'll need to collect as many pieces of the original bout slate as you can, but be cautious. The helms protect the mountain ranges with a manic devotion. They will attack first and ask questions later, so be prepared. Okay, so we need to defeat helms and collect... Uh, but I think this is a good spot to stop. I think it's a good spot before we get into fighting the Helms, because that should be a whole a whole episode on its own, probably. So that's going to do it for this one, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. Drop it a big old like if you did. Subscribe if you have and not. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.